Hello guys, this is Crystal X from I Envy You, and today I'm doing another product display for my dress generator. And you've seen it advertised in my group. Here it is. And I've had a lot of people ask me questions like, um, how does it work? Um, I wish I could see it before I um, purchase it because it's a pretty hefty purchase. And yeah, 60k is a bit expensive, especially if you don't um, generate a lot of um, income through right InView. But it is worth your purchase, and I'm sure you will definitely get your um, usage out of it, or your money's worth. And I'm going to go ahead and give you a demonstration of it. It comes fully layered in an X in XCF format, and yes, I can put in um, PSD for you, but trust me, just use GIMP, it's free, and it's a lot easier. And when you get this, you're going to see a lot of layers, a lot of wire guides. I am unable to move these layers around only because um, of the program that I'm using f to record this but when you get this you can move these layers around and customize it as you like but I can still use it easily because this is just as simple um, making a dress is as simple as viewing the layer that I want to use that's just how easy and um, how simplified I've made this You can even check to see if your dress is going to be AP by using the um, MCG guidelines. So, that said, um, the first thing first when it comes to making a dress is just to choose the opacity that you want for it. And you can even add in your own. I've done this plenty of times. You can draw on your own and all you need is just the white part of it and just to click it and I have about 30 pre-made ones in here for you to use and choose. Well, let me go ahead and get rid of that color layer. Don't need to see that for now. So I'm gonna go ahead and do a couple demonstrations to show you some of the gorgeous dresses you can create with this. Alright so I'm gonna use that opacity map and now I'm gonna choose a color. I have 21 pre-made colors already and you can easily add in more just go to um, add a new layer in your paint bucket tool and click on the foreground color and then change it to whatever color you like and customize it in the change foreground color menu so let me use this nice purple I love how it looks and just paint that entire layer that nice purple color and I'm gonna get rid of this the patterns for now too don't need those um, And I'm going to go ahead and do another color demonstration, just make it a couple more, just so you um, get a feel for it. This blue is gorgeous. And I already have a pink like that. Let's see how this like sable brown. Alright, that's enough for colors, so I'm going to just um, go ahead and use the purple. And from here, I can decide to add a pattern to this or not. Um, just view my pattern layers. You can check it out. I have added eight different patterns, including like ribbing and laces. And I'm going to go ahead and zoom in so that you can um, actually see the details in this, just in case you're not uh, viewing this in HD. So I'm going to go ahead and use that ribbing um, pattern. I like how that looks. And then I have included three pre-made um, shadows and highlight um, templates in here. Two of them which are fully layered and one that comes from my um, Wrinkles um, version 7. It's one of the most popular ones. Everybody loves this one. So I put a lot of detail into the wrinkles. And then this, I have um, the shadows too. 
this one's fully layered you can go in and tweak it how you want um, add less or more highlights or shadows same with this one you can even customize these and change their layer modes to get different effects you can add them together alright so and then above it I have um, a little pixel pack that I made and here you can just um, add in little put the little add-ons in here just to make it more you And sorry, I kind of want to prevent stealing, so I'm just going to copy it and paste it. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and save this dress and show you guys how it looks. Seems I forgot to say the O opacity to this one. Alright, and now as you can see how fast and easy that was to make this dress. And I can go back and change the color, make many different colors of this, and I can add more details. Can go make an outline or something. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to make and do another dress. Just so you guys see that this um little kit is not a fluke. It's the real deal. I'm going to go ahead and add the skin back and I like to use the skin here so you can kind of get a general idea of how your dress is kind of going to look ahead of time. It's like a little cheat. Um, this dress is kind of cute and simple. You can combine dresses too if you want it. Alright, so here's one of my more popular um, dress passes I've made before in the past. And you've seen it in the thrift store. This dress sells so well. Everybody loves it. And I whipped it up um same way, just a dress generator.
And this one's just going to change it just a little bit. Alright, now that I'm done with this dress, I'm going to go ahead and save it. And after I show you this one, I'm going to also do a bodysuit. Um, just to show you what else can be done with this um, generator. Super, super cute, super simple, super fast. And I can just make a ton of these, ton of colors. And if this wasn't a tutorial, I would totally just go in and add a outline to the top there maybe some studs or something just make it super me okay so this is adorable let's go ahead and I'll um, show you how to do this bodysuit now that I was talking about okay so um, essentially you see how simple this works this is easy as changing the opacity map and that's what I'm gonna do I'm Gonna add an opacity map to a bodysuit. And I could have left that black part in, it wouldn't have affected anything. I just prefer um, to have that part white, that way I can see how it looks with the skin. Alright, so now I'm going to choose my color. How about a white bodysuit? That would be kind of different. And again, I can use both of these shadows, just make one um, a little bit less than no opacity, change its layer mode. I just like soft light. Okay, so there's that one. Okay, so have that there. And you want to know it's cool? You can even add your own PVC in here if you have like a um, pre made PVC. Like I do.
And look at that bodysuit that we just made. Kind of cool, right? And I did this with the dress generator. So it can do more than dresses. It can do bodysuits. You can make pants and tops, too. But, um... It, it's just really awesome for creating dresses. Okay, so that was my third product display. And, um... That's pretty much going to conclude this um, video. I'm just going to maybe um, tell you more about the, I guess, the dress generator in, in general. The price is 60,000 credits, and it gets lower based on your membership status within Club Bubblegum AP. And also, for about double the price, you can have it. Um, you can get commercial resale rights on it where you can sell everything that you make with the generator and or you can just give it away to people as gifts whatever you want to do so now that you see how it works see how simple it is and how fun it can be you know just let your creativity go wild um, I hope you this influences you to buy it alright so um, thank you for your time I'm Crystal, and I'm out.